Well, a dramatic rescue is caught on camera. Strangers jumping into action after a woman drove her SUV into the Schuylkill River. And let's head out to Eyewitness News reporter Trang Doe. She is live along Kelly Drive where the woman's SUV still underwater this morning. Trang. Hey, Janelle and Jim. Well, this is the parking lot next to the race grandstands where witnesses say the woman drove her SUV right out of this parking lot, down this dirt path, and straight into the water. But she is okay this morning thanks to some very brave Good Samaritans. Open the door. We can. It was a race against the clock to get to a woman who drove her car off Kelly Drive into the Schuylkill River Sunday. It was startling. It, like At first it was like... Your instinct is to save them, and then it's like you, you get upset because now you're like, I hope they make it out and stuff like that. But it's just, it's incredible. Onlookers from the shore say it appeared the woman didn't want to be saved. It was creepy. She was just sitting there like this, like looking at people, everybody screaming at her. And the car was just floating, 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 sinking, slowly sinking. She didn't want to get out at all. Like, she cussed at the guy, you know, that tried to get her out. She didn't want to get out. Eventually, somebody tossed them a tire iron. They were able to break the window. The men were able to free the woman and then place her inside a passing dragon boat, which rode her to safety. Witnesses and all of the two men who jumped in without hesitation. They're heroes. I believe they're heroes. The, the fact that they, their first instinct was to break that back window and get her out and pull her to safety, very good. Yeah, I talked to one of the guys. He said uh, he, he only did what anybody else would do. So, praise to him. Okay. Taking a live look at the school conditions right now, those good Samaritans declined to be interviewed multiple times. Meanwhile, a dive team is expected back out here sometime this morning. They had tried to get the SUV out yesterday, but the current was just too fast, and then it got really dark. So they're going to make that attempt again later today. But for now, we're live from Kelly Drive. I'm Trang Doe, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Janelle and Jim, back to you. Thank you, Trang.